Welcome back to Andrew Jean Cleaning and Life Hacks. I have four amazing tape tricks that work like magic. And you're gonna be saying to yourself, I cannot believe that I did not know that. Number one, if you ever notice on your tape measure, there's this little hook right in here. This is for something, my friend. It took me almost 30 years to figure that out but it's for grabbing nails or screws. It fits perfectly in there, as you can see. Yes, yes, yes. Let's move on to number two. If you are trying to measure something on your wall right here, you'll notice many tape measures have a pretty rough etched edge right here. It could be bumpy, it's a little bit sharper, and that's because when you're trying to measure something, if you need to make a slight etch right here to know where you need to nail or whatever you need to do, you can see right here, that's what the etching or rough edge is for on the back of the tape measure right here. Moving on to number three. Open up your tape measure and what you're gonna notice here is that, I'm doing this one-handed, your one inch looks smaller than your two inch. And that's for good reason. It is one sixteenth of an inch smaller than your one to two inch mark. But here's what you need to make sure that you do. When you pull it tight, do you see how this metal moves right here? This is one sixteenth of an inch. So when you're measuring, you wanna make sure that you pull it taut so that you have an accurate measurement. Isn't that pretty cool? Just something so simple and every day that I thought, oh my gosh, I cannot believe that I did not know that. But yes, right there. 1 16th of an inch to help you out so you have accurate measurements. Let's move on to number three. On the back of each tape measure, it's going to tell you the length of the base right here. And this one, it says plus three inches. And that's because, let's say you're measuring in a corner such as this, and it can be pretty challenging to get the inside corner. It's awesome that the tape measure bends, but sometimes you're wondering, you're not quite sure, you're trying to get a very accurate uh, measurement right here. Remember, measure twice, cut once. Well, that's where this base comes in handy. What you can do is actually use the base as part of your measurement. So you can take an accurate measurement right here, and then you're just gonna add three inches on because that's the size of the tape measure base. Now there are plenty more tricks when it comes to your tape measure, something that you use every day that is jam packed. If you're looking for some fun and clever shaving cream hacks, click the video on screen now. Give this video a thumbs up, sign up for the weekly newsletter, and I will see you my friend in the next one.